Hi, and welcome back to Unmechanical, where the ominous music is greeting us. Um, let's start by pulling this switch, which doesn't currently do anything. Come on, light bulb friend, let's move on. What's in the next area? Oh, I can't just go behind that, can't I? For a moment there, I thought that was a solid object of some sort. Oh, wow, I'm glad I bought, brought light bulb friend with me. I can't see anything down here. Whoa. I hope there's nothing too spiky and dangerous. Uh, I realise these are branches, but those look far too much like hands. They suddenly got all the more ominous. Down into the dark depths and suddenly cubes. Right. Ah, lights again. Different kinds of lights. Okay. Uh... Oh, now that's definitely organic. That's beating. That's a heart. That's that's not okay. Do I have to put light ball friend into here? Oh shit. I hope so because it's taken it. Um. Can I interact with any of this other stuff? Don't think I can go that way yet. What's over here? You big spiky ball things. Don't look too friendly. I'm slightly worried about you. Well, I can go through that door on the right. So let's see what's through here. Again, more with the green light barriers. Am um, I meant to balance these scales? Yeah, okay. I can see that there's a puzzle involving these scales and those. Uh, right, so... The more weights on it, the further to the right it moves. And I need to... Basically, I need to move that one to the right that'll be one. Which one responds to the second line? And if I, yep, hook that there. Close enough. Yeah, that wasn't too hard. Okay, through to the next area. Back to the more comforting clockworky ticky gears. Switch which appears to be broken. Can we fix it? No, it's broken. Well, I've got a rock, if that helps. Uh, ah, at least I think I can break something with the rock. Yes, I was right, I can break something with that rock. Oh. Well, it solved my problem, if not in the most helpful way. down here. Sorry, little friend, don't mean to bash you. Ooh. Red ball? Well, I can't move you around. Apparently I don't need to. That's fine. What is through here? The music is much more soothing. What? Hello. Purple light orb and what on earth was that that dropped down from the ceiling it looked like a camera of some sort um so i can so when i tap this it shifts that round but what help is that to me right now ah mirrors mirrors i see Shift this mirror around in the right direction. Hmm, that's not going to do it. Whoop. Okay, so it doesn't matter if I go through myself. I probably don't need to start with that mirror then. Oop. Don't laser myself, please. Okay, 
and where can I use this to my D? Huh. Well, that's some kind of puzzle that I can't... I've made a box. It's a very pretty box. But it doesn't do anything. Ah, uh, hang on. From there to there. To... You. And... No. To you. No. That doesn't work. Oh, there's more mirrors underwater. Shit. I didn't even see those. Oh, so that's reflecting it that way and that way. Okay, suddenly it all makes much more sense. And that's down to that mirror. Even more complicated than it first appears. I like it. Ah. Too fast. Round and round she goes. Oh wait, I may not need to use that last mirror. I don't! Solved it. Hooray! Okay, little friend. Let's head on through. Uh, okay, now I need to point the laser down onto you. I can't reach you. Uh, maybe I can shine my laser through this way. Oh, I think I have to shine my laser through this way. Doop, 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 doop. No, that's just going to take me around. So. It's all about figuring what lines the lasers are going to take. Crikey. So with that removed, the laser goes straight through to here and hits the door. Can we get an angle? I don't think we can get any kind of angle where that laser is going to go through. Oh, never mind. It looks like I can go up this way anyway. I may simply have to come back for all that stuff. Oh, we're back up here again. Ah! I think we have to get another little light bulb friend from down here. Can I can I have this please? Hello? Can I can I have this? Beep beep. No. I can't. That's a, that's a shame. No. I can't be inventive and grab that that way. I can hang upside down off it though. Uh, no. That doesn't help. Sadly. No, that doesn't work. Shit. Wait. I had something working then. Oh. So that goes that way, that way, up, down, up, and then refracts off there and back to that mirror again. And off to nowhere. This feels like it should have more use. Surely that can't just be a red herring. I can make it laser itself, which is unhelpful. Ah. Huh. Maybe just having that bottom door open is helpful in some way. Oh, is there a laser I can activate up here that I missed? Doink, sorry. 
Woodly woodly woo. Woodly woo. That's the way I came in, is it? Okay, I don't know anymore. Ooh. No, that's not the way I came in. Hello, what's this place? Oh, another robot. Look, a sweepy thing. Sweepy man, help. I'm stuck. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, hello, what's this? What? On earth is that? Is it an egg? A really, really close up spot? I'm not sure what that is or what I'm meant to do with that. Okay. Uh, well, I can't do anything. Uh, oh, I must, I must be able to connect that up somehow. Never mind. Uh, what's over here that I can use to connect that up? Oh, no, that's a wall. Oh, a rock. I seem to be able to use rocks to solve most of my problems. So let's try solving this problem with a rock. Oh, hang on. Rock sink. Can I grab onto a rock and make it help me sink? Well, if that's the answer, then I've thrown the rocks away. So that's a oh, never mind. There's a way through here with a metal bar, which seems like a much more likely thing to use as a connector. Since you know, metal actually conducts electricity. What is happening there? Okay, that has some profound effect on the water physics. Oh shit, no, I didn't mean to lose the beam. Okay, well, we, me splashing up and down on it has a massive effect on um, the water levels themselves, which is interesting. I think I was meant to leave the beam there to support the block on to connect wire I think again I don't know for certain but I get an inkling that that's what I was meant to do maybe if I just hold the block in place or maybe since the water level rises every time I put something in I'm meant to just fill it and use the water to conduct the electricity that could be it uh grab a rock. So I'm just chucking piles of debris in. So I am solving my problems with rocks. It's not some sort of balancing act where I have to figure out how to balance the I-beam and the rocks and everything else. No, I just have to fill it up. Okay, well, that's done. I thought I'd need to go back for another rock, but I didn't. Through another barrier and into this area here, which is a neon tube in what appears to be a giant desk fan. Okay, now these are cool. What on earth are they, though? Oh, they're mirrors inside gyroscopes! That's cool. So now I just need to figure out what to do with them. And there's my answer. Um in the form of in the form of one of the laser things so what I need to do is put one mirror directly under the laser which will make that reflect that way 
Move the block out of the way. Oh. And then I have to find the balancing point. Okay, so hang on, let's move that a bit closer so that we can actually see what we're aiming at. This gyroscope mirror. Um, I need to try and hold myself up against the ceiling. Oh, there we go. And we've activated it. Fantastic. Now let's go through to here. Oh, that's back through to here. Oh, and now we can move the gyroscope mirrors across. Okay. So, using the gyroscope mirrors... I'll put this down there because I don't know if it sinks. just firing it off that way so it all goes straight through. I don't think it's that gyroscope mirror I need. So that one can sit there. It will be this one over here. Which I need to drag. That way. Yes, it does sit on the surface of the water. I'm all right. So there's one laser just to the left. Uh, come on, we've nearly aimed it right. Doot. Oh, too far. Leave that there. Come on, just a tiny bit more to the right. I mean, I probably could have just dropped it down and left it there. Which would have made sense. Oh, do I even need to use that one? Probably not. I mean, the one with the meter, little thermometer thing next to it, is the one down there. Which I do actually need to use my original doodad for. Wait, do I need both? Oh, I need both. How on earth am I going to do that? Ah, hang on. That's what this block's for, isn't it? Aha! 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 And I just put that gently there. I said gently, damn it. Gently place it on the top on the top of there. I'm gonna need the other one. Laser that way. Take this laser. And if I balance these two on top of each other, which I'm assuming I can do, I can't do that.
Why can I not do that? That must be some sort of way for me to balance those two. But evidently it's not on top of each other. Can I pull this from the side and sit on its side? Not exactly. I'm still a little stuck as to what I'm meant to be doing here. above each other. Oh. Uh, idiot. I need one of these blocks. Where is a double-sided fool? So that one plays through that way nudge this slightly to the side. Slightly to the side. So that it's hitting both. And then I just leave it to do its job. And I get another light ball. Light ball comes with me. All the way. Up here. To this strange pulsating Heart. I really don't know why I'm ringing light balls here. It just seems like my only way up, my only way forward. Ha. Huh. I hope this has some sort of good outcome and doesn't end the world because this looks massive and ominous and horrifying. Oh well. Hopefully you'll find out more with me next time on uh, Unmechanical. See you all in the next video.